Hey guys, it's Marcus from Lothian Bagpipes again. We're here in Dunedin, Florida. Uh, today I'm going to demo this new Strobo tuner uh, from Peterson Tuners. Some of you guys know Peterson's known for their uh, real precise tuners, real accurate tuners. Um, this is the Strobo Plus. Uh, this is paired up with their uh, unidirectional microphone. Uh, this combination with Peterson's new Great Highland Bagpipe Sweetener makes an amazing drone tuner. It also makes an amazing tuner for both uh, tenor and uh, bass sections. So we're going to demo it today. We're going to show you how the tuner works. Uh, if you have any questions about it, you can feel free to contact us at 727-733-6838 or visit us online at lothianbagpipesupplies.com. Thanks. The Peterson Strobo Plus HD tuner is incredibly easy to operate. Simply set the sweetener on the right to GHB for Great Highland Bagpipe, set your baseline frequency on the left with the rotary knob, and start tuning up your band. Lothian Bagpipe Supplies offers the tuner in two packages, the full pipe band package you see here or just the tuner by itself. The full pipe band package comes with the tuner in its hard case with magnetic closure, a unidirectional microphone, a rotating swivel mount that's hidden here underneath the mic cord, and a short boom extension that makes the entire rig easily operated by one person. The first step in using this tuner with your pipe band is setting the baseline frequency. Here I start with a low frequency at 470 and bring it up with the rotary knob until it matches my reference drones, meaning the indicator bars actually stop moving. Once the tuner is dialed in, simply click the rotary knob to lock it in. The key here is finding a piper that's already been tuned, use him or her as your reference, and pitch the band to the same. Here, James Everett from the Dunedin Pipe Band makes his way around the band tuning each set of drones to the same frequency as our reference pitch. If the bars are moving right, the drones are too sharp. If the bars are moving left, the drones are too flat. Simply adjust one drone at a time using the external microphone roughly two inches off of the top of the drone. Here's a close-up that really shows off the Strobo Plus HD's precision. Again, if the indicator bars are moving to the left as they are here, the drone's flat and needs to be sharpened. Once the bars stop moving, the drone is perfectly in tune. And here, I'll sharpen the drone so you can see how the tuner reacts. If the bars are moving right, like they are now, the drone's too sharp and it needs to be flattened until the bars stop moving. Have you ever tried to tune both heads on a tenor or bass drum with a standard chromatic tuner like this one? Not so easy because the tuners aren't very responsive and are difficult to interpret. But look at how easy it is with the Strobo Plus HD with our pipe band package. Make sure to place the external microphone 6 to 8 inches off of the drum head. You want to make sure that you're picking up the drum's full resonant tone. Here this tenor is tuned perfectly to A. Flip the drum over, perform the same procedure on the bottom head. You'll be amazed at the tone you get out of your tenors and bass once both heads are perfectly in tune with each other. This was recorded indoors with a drum core about 20 feet away having practice, which is why you see a little jumpiness, but you can clearly see each time the drum is hit how the tuner picks up the drum's true resonant pitch. And there you go. That was a demo of the new Strobo HD Plus tuner, specifically geared for uh, bagpipes and pipe bands. Uh, remember, for under $300, you can't beat it. The Dalriata tuner is a lot more expensive than this. The Chesney tuner, if you can find them, is a lot more expensive than this. This entire rig, uh, you can get from us for less than $300. Uh, it's a great deal at a great price. It does a fantastic job tuning everything in your pipe band. So, again, if you guys have any questions, definitely let us know. Thanks.